So what we got, we stopped this trade this morning. So early on in the session, let's take a look at it. This is the momentum chart that we use. We let the algo do the work for us. You look for the first wave, first wave here, after you get optic color speed bars against ATR trend, there's your first wave this morning. Then we got the second wave. Then we were down here when I was on the mic this morning. I don't like to look at third and fourth waves, even though it got the first target off, it's third wave. We're down here, I said look for the deep retracement up to the 60%, 60, 62% retracement. Stop right in my zone, another big trade. Caught that one. But here was the big move that we we're stocking this morning. And this, we had a big heads up. I talked about this at 8.30 this morning. I said we want to turn green ATR dots. Once we turn green ATR dots, all six green, which we did, we had a big heads up on this trade. All right, 8.30 this morning, we got the trade right here at the low at almost 9 New York open, around 9.26 this morning. Per two contracts, it's moved up around 3,500 so far. With a small stop, two ticks below the swing low. And this was the first wave, first wave after turning all green six. We stalked this trade. We talked about this trade this morning. I said we need to turn all six green ATRs. Then you wait for opposite color speed bars. So let me blow this up. This is the rhythm of it. You get a wave one, which is a, here's, your first wave, you get a second shot at it with the second wave. That's trail moved up, guys. Now we're over four per two contracts. Trail just moved up on this. We're still moving, still trailing. Here's a three. So you get three shots at it on this wave, uh, these waves. So the algo, there's number one. The first wave is number two. Number three. Three is a deep retracement. And then right when it got outside the deep retracement after the third wave. Right when it got outside at that level, we looked for green ATR dots to form. So, the key is this, when you get six of my zones, one, two, three, four, five, six, when you get six zones that turn green, you look for the first opposite color speed bars to come in. Here's your opposite color speed bars. There's your opposite color speed bars that came in. Once you get that, what you're going to do is you're going to look for your oscillator down here to pull you in. Magenta above 90 is a really good way to do it. There's your magenta above 90 on the oscillator. Here's your pulling bar to get long. Now we're looking for a second wave. We're looking for opposite color speed bars now to come in again. There's our move up. Here's our trades this morning so far. We had wave, wave. This is the big wave. This is when it got the momentum bar. This is the momentum. Trail still running on this trail, but this is the momentum that we talked about. We're getting a second one coming up right now. We got another wave pattern coming up. Optic color speed bars are coming in. We're looking for another move up. Right now, we need to pull in. I'll get this off. Off. We need to pull in. The jump above 90, see if we can get a pull in. The trail is still trailing from this level right here at this level, if you're still trailing. So now we're looking for another move up. We're looking for another move up right here. We're looking for another stem up because we're getting, you see, there she goes. Market's moving back up. We had optic color speed bars come in. So the, the whole method behind this uh, um, this algo is we're trying to catch the we're trying to catch the rolling position traders, and we're trying to catch the 
rolling position traders, and we're trying to catch the uh, rolling position algos, etc. Okay, by looking for offset color volume spikes right here, or offset color speed bars, we call them. Hop in the market. This sets the whole trade up against overall ATR push. Right there it is. All right, you can see how we're coming off of it again. Came off of it here really hard. That was a huge move. Like Tina said, what Tina got filled at 80 and a quarter on that trade. Good fill, Tina, on the 80 and a quarter, and the potential was all the way up to 04. That's 20, almost 25 point S&P point move off the algo calling this low. Now the algo calls it again. This is my second wave structure up. Right here, you got optic color speed bars. Comes right down to it. You get pulled in, and now we're getting another nice move up again. All right, so you wait. A lot of traders are just using this momentum chart to wait for these setups. If you look at it, let's look at the downside and upside. It caught the first wave down there, caught the second wave down there to pull in. We don't like taking the third wave because of the, we like the deep retracement then, which we'll look today too. So we'll keep an eye on this deep retracement now. So now the third setup, we'll look for this deep retracement down here and we'll try to fire in the trade as far as that goes. Okay? But you try to you try to position yourself on that first wave. That first wave right here is key. You get six green. You look for the first retracement to go long. The oscillator can pop you in. All right, oscillator can pop you in, or what you can do is you can trail it like this. This is still trail. It has not hit break even plus one yet. These hit break even plus one earlier. You can see the ATR is still pushing up. ATR is still pushing up hard. So we're still pushing. So since 7.50 this morning, we've had buy side setups. This is the best one because this is the first momentum buy. We turn six green right here. Six green right there. Six green ATR dots. I like when optic color speed bars come in. And there's your first big push. All right. Then you got a second shot at it. Second shot at it right here. It bounced out of the zone. Third shot I do not like to take unless you come down to the deep zone. So I'm looking for a deep zone pullback here at the 62% retracement for continuation. But that's a 25 point S&P potential move just on the first wave up. Second wave looks nice also. Third wave will be down here at the 60% retracement. And we'll look for that also.